man who gave us blue suede shoes, dropping the blues. Honey, don't. And this great song called Flashback. Carl Perkins, Carl the Rock. I'm sitting here wondering, Matchbox holding on my clothes. I'm sitting here wondering, Matchbox holding on my clothes. Well, I ain't got no match, you better show that a long way to go. I'm an old folk boy, I'm a long way from home. I'm an old folk boy, I'm a long way from home. Well, I've never been happy, cause everything I do is wrong. If you don't want my peace, young, please don't shake my tree. If you don't want my peace, young, don't mess around with my tree. That's how all of New York City is. It's either you're a multi-millionaire living at, you know, in the in the hundred thousand a month apartments, or you're living in the projects or the Lower East Side, you know. So it's yeah. like there ain't no middle class in New York City. Well, I, I worked out some songs and I decided to try to play them for the public and you know, maybe make it through. Times are hard for music. I said, "Where's the village?" They told me Washington Square Park. I took the train here. I'm from Brooklyn originally. I took the A train, I came to watch the Square Park. That was about 20 years ago. I got locked up by the um, park, by the, um, the chess boards. I ended up doing 10 years of prison. I just came home, but I'm pretty much, you know, homeless right now. I'm living in the park, you know. Um, I'm just trying to survive day to day. You know, it's a struggle. But you do pretty much whatever you gotta do to survive. You know, whether you have to suck a cock, you know, or, or you have to, you know, make money with fake drugs or whatever. You just, don't take my picture. Beat it. Thank you. Because my sister died last a year, nine months ago. So I lost everything. I ended up in the stage. The, the only way, the only way to learn learn from anything is by mistakes. If you don't learn from your mistakes, then you know what, then you're, then you're a fool. If you trip over a rock, if you if you trip over your laces, you know, what do you say to yourself? Oh, I should tie my sneakers. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? No, if you don't tie your sneakers, then you're gonna trip over your laces again. You know what I'm saying? It's simple mathematics, you know? I ended up doing 10 years for that, for a crime I never committed. So I sold drugs. Then when I came home, I was faced with a dilemma because I already have a, a record. Nobody want to hire me, so I ended up back in this park, you know. And we just—I just survive on a basis, on a on a daily basis, man. Whatever I can do, I can sing. Sometimes I sing. Sometimes, you know, I just—you know—I panhandle. Sometimes I just play game, you know. Fake coke, fake weed, whatever I, whatever I can do just to survive. You know, it's cold and it's and it's and it's, it, it's very extreme, but you, you really do what you gotta do just to survive. Well, New York's the great melting pot. Every everyone from different country, different classes, they all get together. It was always called that, the, uh, the melting pot. New York is it's just a place that's, you know, it's fast, it's ongoing, and either you in or you out. Meaning that either you're making money, if you're not making money, then you, you're considered like homeless, you know. Once, once you're labeled with a certain type of, um, a certain type of um, charge, or a certain type of, um, I don't know the word right now, but when you're labeled in this society as a, as a misfit, so to speak, you get nothing. In, or, in order to survive, in order to survive as a human being, you, you have to have your ego minimize, you know, minimize. Every day you talk to people, you know, so you, I, I read the news every day, so sometimes you, 
you think you're awesome, but you think you're bad, but you know, you see a lot of things worse. Right? Like that thing that happened last week in Colorado. So when these things happen, you, you see you, you're, not, you're not too bad. You can't you can get bad. You, know, you go through life and you have opportunities. Sometimes you, know, you take advantage, sometimes they miss opportunities. But, uh, I had a great time. I had a great time. I mean, my, all my life I had money. <laughs> now I don't. That's the difference. I mean, ever since, ever since I was a kid, I was always back and forth in New York City since I was just a little shit. So now, now I'm, I don't have to sleep on the bench anymore. Now I got a place. You, know, so. you, you, you ever sat up and, and watch and watch all the stars I love you, up, man. Up, up, up in the air? You know what I'm saying? You see, you see one shooting star going across. Nobody will believe you. If you tell them, I saw a shooting star, they won't believe you, man. They won't believe you. They won't believe you. I love you. I love you too, man. Love you too. That was going drugs bad. But then after a while, drugs really didn't, didn't please me anymore. So I started drinking, and that's where I'm at now. I drink. You know, it's all about pain. You're trying to subside the pain. You know, it's a lot of pain, it's a lot of rejection. And you know, we, they don't give us counseling. It's not like you get psychological counseling. So you have to do whatever it takes to, 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 to really survive, you know. So my my way is to drink. I forget about it, you know, and it's cool with me. Now, I'm adjusted to it, I'm adapted to it. I mean, it's natural to me now.